All right, so we're gonna do something adventurous. I'm gonna show you what uh, pretty much stock file does. As you guys know, it did run, but I would have to like throttle it quite a bit to get it to run. I had to put like two washers underneath the throttle blade and I would have to hold it at like 20 something percent throttle. So what I wanna do is one clip with screen capture, show you guys this angle, what I'm doing on the computer from pretty much stock file uh, to hopefully running if it works right. So I did this already. I'm just, I undid the changes. I'm redoing the changes. So that's what it's going to be. So I'm going to come over here and I'm going to start my screen capture software using OBS. OBS, guys. OBS. And I thought I had it open already, so this is uh, really uh, an excessive part of the video that I didn't need. So now I'm going to go back into the uh, Microsquirt software that I have open. And what I want to show you guys is that this is logging right now, but it's not going to run. So there's some things that are wrong with the tune right away. So like the injector size is wrong, the engine size is wrong the fuel map and the ignition map are scaled wrong not wrong but just that's how it comes on the computer so you got to scale it to what you need it to be so i have a three bar map sensor in it and it's uh it just doesn't have the right stuff in there so let's put it in there you can see the throttle position is at negative 4.4 and that's not right so we got to calibrate that so i just want to show you that it doesn't run
instead of trying to make it really, really difficult on myself. So I'm going to do three bar. So I'm going to go to 300 here. Uh, 281.3. Oh, 281. Let's let's be smart here. 300. Enter. 281, 0.3, 262.5, 243.8. And basically all I did here was take 16 cells. I took 300 divided 16 cells and subtracted each one equally. So I don't know if that's the right way to do it, but that's what I'm going to do. 25. Feel, feel free to scroll forward if you need to in the video. If you don't have any patience for trying to figure out how to actually do stuff, Point eight. Can you get that, baby? Um. Yeah, hold on a minute, bud. That was my uh, that was my two-year-old. He wants me to turn the boss baby on the TV show, something like that. So one twelve point five. Yeah, maybe you guys should just scroll forward because this is a long process. So this is kind of, uh, if you were just to copy another file over, I guess, because um, that would work too. Like if you had a good working file that you knew was fine and you decided you wanted to do that. so. I'm gonna burn that now that I made all the changes on the, the fuel table, and then we'll go over to the ignition table. Ignition table, so this is also um, set up for one bar originally, just out of, the, out of the gate. So I'm gonna put this at 300, so it'll be a little quicker because it's only 270, or it's only 12 cells. <laughs> And uh, it's, it goes in 25 increments, so 250, uh, 225, 200, whoop, not 3200, 200, 175. Fuck, I might not even, I might not even need a calculator for these things, guys. Uh, 175. 50, I'll do uh, 25, I'll burn that. So we changed the injector size, we changed uh, the engine size, we changed the timing map and the, uh, the fuel map, and now I'm going to cycle it on and off. We did reset the TPS before, but what I might still have to do is open the TPS about 4%. So we'll see what it does. So what I want to try to do now... Turn the computer so I can actually see it. I want to watch the throttle position. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the throttle position. I'm going to open it four percent, and then I'm going to reset it back to zero. So I'm just going to take this thing and twist it until we set it about four and a half percent. Might be too much. That 
it's about five and a half. Probably worth though. Let's try it. Oh, uh, that was about three percent. We'll go a little more. We'll get a little more sauce, guys. Hold on, bud. Wait a minute. So 4.7, so that should be perfect. Uh, so we'll see what's gonna happen. So I'm gonna take the computer again. I'm gonna reset the throttle position, which I probably should have did this last, I think, but. Uh, we'll go down, recalibrate throttle position, get current, push it down. Get current, accept, and we'll do it again. Get current, push it down, get current, accept. Now we'll grab at zero throttle position. And then I'm gonna take the computer and put it up here. I'm gonna cycle the key. Kids are being noisy. I'm trying to get them to shush up because we're doing a one clip. No edit, right? Everything one clip here and then one clip on the screen capture. It was a no start condition, basically stock file to a, a one push start and idle condition in like 11 minutes, 11 and a half minutes. Hopefully, you enjoyed the video. Turn boss baby on. Hold on a minute. <laughs> Alright. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.